Hello everyone. Welcome back to Data Wave interview question series. First, I would like to thank you so much for everyone. We have reached 1K followers in our YouTube channel. Okay. In this video, we are going to discuss about below Data Wave interview questions. First, try to understand what is the problem statement. Okay. First one is find the largest and smallest number from an array. So what is the largest number here? So we need to identify the largest one is 55. Next smallest one is two, right? Okay. This is what we have to identify by using data view scripts. Next. Second question, find oldest and youngest person from a JSON object. See, this is also similar to this one only, but so here we need to get entire object. Okay. So there are multiple objects here, right? One, two, three. So here, what is the oldest age? Okay. Age is 55. Okay. You need to print this one. And next. What is the youngest person? Okay. Here, Ravi is 25 so 30 it's in a middle okay see both are different questions but it is a little bit similar okay now let's do it in a practical way go to data wave playground let me copy this So either you can paste it here, okay? Or else we can create a variable. Okay, we'll do it in both the ways, okay, fine. Now, in order to find, see if you print payload, the entire payload will get displayed. But here we need maximum and minimum, right? Okay, max number and minimum number. So in order to first try to understand, so here we do have function called max. So max is a function. See here, if you type payload, you'll get the maximum number. If you go with minimum, minimum number, it is displaying here. Just do maximize a little bit. Okay. Now, now we need to print both. So how to do this? It's very simple. Okay. Max number. So here, what we need to do? Max function you need to use. And it is payload. See now you are getting the max 55. Now, minimum number. It's very simple. Min payload. Okay. So now you can able to see max is 55, minimum is 2. So this one, suppose now it is in a payload, right? Okay, both are same only, but suppose if you want to keep it in a variable where numbers equal to like this, also you can keep it. Okay. But instead of payload, what we can, what we need to use, we need to use numbers. See, both are correct only. Okay. So one question is done. One is done. What is the next question? So largest and smallest, max number and minimum number, both are same. Okay. Now, find the oldest and youngest person. Okay. Now let's copy this input. Copy this input. So I'll take another uh, playground, okay? Just type, go to Google and type database playground. Click on this. Now, 
what I will do instead of testing payload, I'll take it from where input equal to suppose instead of input, what I will do, I'll keep it as persons where persons equal to number of objects. It's an array, correct? Now, if you print persons, you will get the, you will get all the values here, correct? All the values. But what is our requirement? Oldest and youngest, correct? Now, very simple. So I need to create an object. Oldest person. See here, here we have used max and min, right? Okay, this is an array. So inside an array, we do have values. So there we can use max and min. But here, we need to use min by. Okay, min by. dollar dot h so now here we are getting one error right okay before this we need to use payload so what is the payload here it's like what is the input the persons okay it's very simple persons min by h, okay, now. Oldest, so it's a oldest, right? Okay, oldest means max. Okay, let, let me change this, okay, instead of oldest, what is the value? Youngest, right, okay. First we'll write youngest person. Youngest now, oldest or old, whatever it is feasible, you can do that. But this one is very important. So the input is present in persons now. Oldest means maximum is right, okay? The highest is you need to use it, okay? Max by. I'll show you another way by using item also. Dollar dot h. See now. It's our expected output. Correct. Youngest person and oldest person. Now, how we can do this in another way by using item. So that's also very simple. Let me copy this or else let me comment out. So how to comment? You can select and control slash. How to do this? You want to do multiple control plus slash. Okay, this is gonna work. Okay, again, if you want to Do it in another way. Very simple. So who is young? See, both are same only. Okay. Young person or youngest person. I'll keep it as this young. So if you go with persons, okay, persons. You will get all now. Ing means min by. So here you will get the item, right? Okay. So item dot h. See here. 
So instead of this, we used to use dollar. Okay, we have used dollar. Now the same thing. Who is old here? Persons, you can use max by item dot h. Now we have resolved both the issues. I mean, the two questions. One is find the largest and smallest number from an array. So by using max and min, we can resolve that. Next, there is an JSON object. Okay, I mean it's an array. Inside this, we do have objects. From objects, we need to identify who is young and who is oldest. So that's very simple. You can do it in two ways. Okay. Either you can use this or you can use, but here we need to use min by and max by. That's very important. That's it for this video. If you like the content, please do hit a like button and share it with your friends. Please do subscribe our channel. Thanks for watching this. We'll meet you in a, another video. Thank you.